this is my baby girl Nadia. She's just 18 months old there. And I can't quite believe it, but she's going to be nine tomorrow. Where have the years gone? Anyway, I'm trying to be a bit quiet because I've just put her to bed and I've still got all this lot to wrap. I'm just going to run through some of the things I got for her birthday. So these are uh, the chocolate lollipop moulds. Um, she loves making them with her friend when her friends come over. Just two pounds, and I got that from George Home. She wears glasses sometimes for uh, watching telly and in the classroom. This was just a pound from Peacocks. Another pug-related accessory. This one was a bit more expensive than a pound. By the way, that glasses case that I got was reduced. It was originally five pounds. This was four pounds. Um, can't recall where I got this from. This was just two pounds and I think I picked this up from Dunham Mill. I was running out of ideas so it was all pug related. Lip balm from Claire's Accessories. A bit more expensive but I thought she'd really like this. Four pound fifty. You can pick up some really good bargains at Tesco's. I got these which are I think two or three pounds each. Um, so that was a cereal box um, mini town and this is like puffy paint that you can put on clothes or accessories and I got these for 50p each I picked up a couple of them and she loves as most girls do you know decorating and gluing and sticking and that sort of thing oh and these came from Tesco's as well also reduced to something ridiculous like 20 or 30p on the clearance shelves it's really a good idea to go in there look for these clearance shelves. Every, every time I go in, I go and have a look at what they've got. And these little notebooks, I think they were like 30p or something like that. Oh, again, on the clearance, it's been discontinued. They're trying to get rid of it. So I start buying things throughout the year for things like uh, birthdays and Christmas. I think I'm reminiscing about my childhood when I thought of this present. I love Dini Blyton, so I'm hoping she'll get into it as well. A couple more bits, got her some super tips washable of course so she loves um coloring but yeah washable if it gets on the fabric it does just wash out it's so handy and she's also got a thing for um gems and crystals and stone precious stones so i found this in the entertainer for just a few quid so i thought Ooh, that'll do gold rush mining set she's gonna get plenty of hours of entertainment out of this as you can see, Nadia loves pugs, but I've got a great surprise for her. So we can't get her a pug, unfortunately, because we work full time. But I thought the next best thing would be to arrange for her to go and walk some, go and visit some and walk some. So I've put a note out in the um, local pet shop and on streetlife.com. It's like a community forum. Um, so you can put in your postcode and chat with others in your community said that you know my daughter loves pugs and would anyone like their pug walked and lo and behold someone's come forward to say yes please um so we're gonna i'm gonna take her there after school um on her birthday and uh, and see what she thinks of the pugs hopefully it'll become a regular occurrence <laughs>
this week guys hope you enjoyed the video diary just before I scoot off just wanted to highlight um, I've got some great deals on um, travel interiors and lifestyles on the website the weekly deals section here's the short link to go visit sorry I'm scratching my ear because I've got an itch um, and secondly um, yeah do sign up to my newsletter because I've got some wonderful prizes to give away this week um, and you can also find out about exclusive deals and stories that I've written elsewhere have a great week and hope to catch up with you next week